Dr Bridget here again and today I want to talk to you about whether you have a choice as to whether to have a good week or a bad week and this topic's been precipitated by a couple of clients I've had in the last week who really have been having some bad weeks rung me up for some support and you know there's a common pattern that goes through people that have bad weeks so external things happen and well I know that we're in charge of our reality so you know we can attract good things and ignore the bad things sometimes life does get in the way and people that have bad weeks generally have the following problems so they've lost sight of their goals if they had any in the first place They've stopped being themselves, so they're, they, you know, perhaps they've crossed their boundaries, they're, they're not being themselves and they're not happy. Then they've lost their belief. So that might not be, so they might have 100% belief in themselves in their, whatever they're doing. It only needs to be 5% loss of belief. And sometimes the effect that that has will cause you to start to doubt yourself Often people in business, because I work with some people in business, they'll back off. So they, they'll sort of, you know, subconsciously back off from perhaps closing a sale, um, talking to the right people. They have doubts. And then before they know where they are, you know, all that's sort of gone into sort of a downward spiral. So if you're having a bad week, maybe you need to think about, have you got goals? Are you sticking to them? Are you being you? Are you working with your, your values? So what's important to you in your life? And do you fully, and I mean fully, believe in yourself and what you're doing? Because when you have a good week, you're definitely going for your goals, you're taking action, um, you're being you, you fully believe in yourself. If something comes in from left field, if life throws something at you, you're resilient and you just go, well, next, you know, move on to the next and learn from it. So that's the difference between a good week and a bad week in my view. So if you're having lots and lots of bad weeks, maybe you need to work on these and get in touch for a free session. And uh, I shall Look forward to working more closely with you and delivering another prescription for success next week. Bye.